I'm too late. I'm too late. I'm in the forest and I'm going to look for the, the red there, maybe some road there today. And uh, yeah, I, I haven't been here for a wee year. I was here last summer and there was a lot of uh, deer then. So I have no idea if there are gonna be any deer in this place here. But yeah, as always, it's always great and excitement yeah, when you're waiting for animals or birds. But the challenge today is there is quite windy, so I'm not uh, uh, I'm not sure how the uh, animals are going to react to that. But I need to find out and see. Good to be out in the forest again, and uh, yeah. So let's go. come out to uh, to feed on the grass and since I was here last year I'm too late I'm too late they are already out starting to come out now. Ah, no, 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 no. Okay, this is one of the lessons. Okay, I need to leave my bag here. Only take my camera. It's hard for them to see inside the forest. The problem is the wind is blowing directly to them. Ah, this is hard. Really hard. They did smell me. They just come right at me. And the wind is blowing directly into their face. So, okay, I need to go click quickly. They are going back to the forest now and hopefully uh, some of the other dares will come back. So, uh, okay, I need to be quick. there in another field I need to go to the other side of the field because then I have a better chance if they come out the woods and the wind is much much better there not good but better the there is gone and now I need to act really quickly I'm on the other side now 
And I'm not sure if I'm going to stay here. I'll try to go a little bit further in. I think I might try to go 10 to 15 meters and then settle down. I'm using the ghillie blanket to camouflage myself. It's actually long enough to to cover myself and in front of my camera as well. Hopefully the wind will blow on the side and I'm pointing straight forward so if they come out in the forest in front of me hopefully they won't pick up my scent. I remember last year when I was here, when I found this place here. It was so exciting when I found it there. And uh, one day I actually had there surrounding me. I was absolutely still and the deer didn't see me. So that was quite an experience to get the red deer that close. That is not that often you experience that. They are so afraid and so aware of the environment, of the danger around. So they are constantly checking uh, the surrounding to see if there are any danger. And that makes this kind of photography so much harder as well. But now I'm camouflaged and I hope I hope there will come some more there uh, out a little bit later on the evening. That would be really cool. So this kind of photography is a lot a lot of waiting sometimes you can wait for many hours before anything happens there is some there now but it's much more for further away hopefully they work that the way down here The other one is grassing. Something spooked them. They went back into the forest. I'm not sure why. It's just my guess, but I'm guessing this is the same animals that picked up my scent when I was in the forest. It's a mother and a calf 
from last year. There is another dare now. I'm guessing maybe 400 meters. But hopefully it will come closer. It's starting to get dark now. So I'm not expecting the any good pictures, but uh, hopefully the experience and the video will be okay. using a teleconverter on my 500 millimeter so I got a lot of power but I'm losing a lot of light now so I'm, I think maybe I should take it off so I can get the F4 and hopefully they move a little bit closer This was cool. 
really cool. I finally got the there and the road there. And on top of that, when I walked into the forest, I saw two badgers. Too dark to film. Too dark to film, but what an experience. It was, uh, I think it was a 10, 10 meters from me. I hope you enjoyed this little dare adventure of mine. And I'm definitely going to make more of these. I did not get any good pictures, but it was a really great experience. I think I got some good video though. But uh, yeah, I will put some picture I made last year so you can see some something that I made from this place so yeah I will see you next time bye